What's up, everybody? Welcome back. Itachi. Itachi, as I said. Um, and his shield, Susano. I don't know what it's called. I don't know if it's like the humanoid one. There's so many different types, you know. I, can't, I don't know what this one's called. I'm sure someone will tell me in the comments. I just call it the shield one because it's got this shield on the side, right? So we're going to draw that today. Landscape page. Use a pencil and eraser and hit pause if I go too fast. So let us go. We're going to start with his big pointy nose. So you're just going to go center point of my page about here. I'm just going to come across and up a little bit. And the nose is going to go this way like a big Pinocchio sort of. Line like that. So it's real sharp at the top and then comes back down. Like so. And then the nostril, just in here. We have a cheek line going that way. A cheek line going that way. He's a big frown here, big curving frown line with an eye, a dark eye here, like circle. There's like a shadow part here, so it's just black inside here. Right, so his mouth, right? We'll come down here. So we'll go down there. And then it comes right across like this, real big mouth, right? And then just here we've got like a tooth. And then the mouth is kind of open here with teeth. So we'll do the top teeth. So it comes across. And then there's a sharp sort of fang here. Teeth lines. And then the rest goes that way. The next gap, so it goes down, joins to there, and then the next line. Lots of these sort of wrapping, curving lines. It's like he's wrapped in bandages or something. This one here. And then eyes inside, like these are glowing white eyes now. Sort of egg-shaped eyes. Right, and then it's all dark around. Right, so we can see an ear here. Just the ear shape curves around. Like so, kind of like a letter C. And then cartilage ear lines inside. So the easiest way to begin with this is the letter J, I think. And then we add these spikes around like so. He's got a diamond on his forehead, right? So it's a particular kind of shape. So he's got like a frown line here first, actually. Like this. Like that. And then this jewel goes at angles. So it goes up, down, to there. 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 This goes around, down, to there. It's the edge, and then this comes down. Like that, and then a couple of lines on the inside, like so. So he's like this big thing of energy. So we've got all these like waving lines. Not really. It's like hair, but it's it's not hair really. It's energy, right? Just going that way. And then he seems to have a big one that goes around his face. And then all these spikes on the inside. So what 
to do. We do the one so like big big spike here. Like that. And then this one comes around its face. So it goes right so up around this way. This will go there right okay and then before I do any more of that what we'll do is we'll fill in the bandage and things inside here so I think they're bandages so just come around he's like wrapped he's mummified all right so this one comes around Inside here, right, and then all energy on top this way. So like it's kind of like flame spikes, right? So you just add these. It all moves and like you know flickers and things. So if yours isn't exactly like mine, don't worry too much. They can move around, you know. They do in the anime. So so don't worry too much about. That. You're just looking for a general sort of shape. It's not. It doesn't have to be exact. And then he's got this earring sort of hanging down here. It's it's the same shape as uh, the what Naruto has on his collar. You know when he's in six paths. And it's the Tomei, or is that what it's called? You know, that's in the Rasengan as well. There's just another shadow part here I missed. Okay. Then, finish the body around here. So, again, wrapped, mummified. Lots of these sorts of lines coming around. Like that. And then there is a shoulder, but it's sort of on fire as well, so. Maybe like a bit of flame flicking up this way. Like so. Okay, and then I'm gonna put some just some like energy kind of escaping here. Like that. Okay, so then the shield just here right so let's see so we'll start the spike coming out of this part so it goes down around like that and then i have a bit of a spiral here back down sort of flame flick here another one this way we got maybe a spiral inside here and then it goes down off my page so this is like a big shield right and then like some more flames sort of going that way there's a big spiral on the inside, like Naruto's symbol on his back. All these 
on his shoulder and his back. All these symbols keep coming up in Naruto. Spiral, spiral out. Another one here. So, and all this stuff. So crisscrossing one another. Like that. So all this flame. Uh, and that's the Sasano, right? So, and again, if you want, like, you can add Itachi in here. Um, if you want. Will I? Let me see. He's real small, so I don't know if I'll be able. And we'll just do a silhouette, right? So I'll just do sort of... Well, I'll color it in black because you can't really see it, right? So I'll just do a bump. There's his head, his collar sort of sticks out that way. Right in there as well. And then we've got a shoulder, so he's all cloaked. It's kind of easy to more or less cloak coming down here. He goes in. In. And at the bottom of the cloak kind of comes around. That way and back up. And then just two legs sticking down there. And then you just color that black. Of course, you can leave this out if you don't like it. I changed my paper and I don't like it. It's like it's super absorbent or something and it it's like it's all getting all coming off. It's really annoying. I bought loads of it. Oops. It wasn't always like this. Maybe they changed the way it was made or something. Come on, buddy. Just keep it consistent, will you? Oh, it's wasting again. I think it's the page, though. It's like absorbing all the ink. <sighs> okay, but apart from my complaint about my paper, It's not too bad. That is how to draw Itachi and his Susano, his shield Susano. That's what I call it. Could be called something else officially, but that's what I'm calling it. That's what I'm sticking to. You can't make me change. Do do do. Just make this a little bit darker. Okay. Hope it's helpful. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Bye.